Here I am back in my Flash project. I have my circle graphic in my library and I want to make a movie clip in which I'm going to tween this circle. So I'm actually going to go and insert a new symbol. This time I'm going to choose movie clip and let's call this uh, moving circle because that's what I'm going to do. Say so, okay. Now I'm inside the movie clip. The first thing I want to do is drag in a version of my graphic. So let's have him be right here. There's my circle. Now what I can do is treat this just like a flip book where it's going to like scroll through the pages really quickly and it's going to look like the thing is animating. And what I can do is make use of my frames and I can just define on each frame what I want the circle um, to be at at that moment. So let's go to on frame two. I want to um, copy the circle and then I'll move it. To copy it, I'm going to hit F6. That's going to make a copy of the previous keyframe. But now I can change where this one is. And if I go back, you'll see that's still there on the first frame and another, um, the next frame, it's, it's further away. There's something I can use to sort of help me position these, and it's these onion skin buttons. And it will show me a little um, shadow view of where I was last time, so I can get an idea of where my path is. So let's just keep moving this guy around. Let's do F6 again. Let's move it a little bit over here. And I'm just going to keep going and moving this guy in sort of a little circle. And um, you'll see as I do this, some of the onion skinned ones are going away because it only shows me steps that are surrounded with this thing. I can drag this back to the beginning. That way I can continue to see my full path. Let me keep dragging this guy. And I'm basically just repeating this. Let me do this a little faster. It's going to be. Um, shakier animation the faster I go, but then we'll get done with this faster, and you can see the effect. So I'm close enough. Um, if I want to see what this looks like real fast, I can just go back to the first frame and hit enter. It'll play through. If I want to test what this looks like as a movie, I can go control test movie. Oh, that's right, I don't have it on my scene one. Let me go back to scene one and drag this movie clip on from the library. This is the movie version. Control test movie. There it is. I can also do that by hitting control enter and I get to see the movie again. So that's how you animate with frame by frame animation in Flash.